Rain, clouds, cooler. Lonnie? But getting better outside. I mean, take a look right here. The sky's so much better now. We continue to have more and more clearing. 66. Temperatures just went up by 2 degrees in the last hour. That is the high temp of the day. 59 has been the high so far in the Hamptons. 78, the high temperature in Atlantic City. So 50, 60s, almost 80, depending on where you lived. 60 degrees overnight. Continued clearing with the skies. Could be some patchy fog setting up and then into your day tomorrow. 76. Again, a big range in temperatures, cooler out east, but do not rule out the chance for a rogue storm to come through later in the day tomorrow. I'll show you what's going on. We've got one little rogue storm right now, just one. It's right on the, oh, the Sullivan Orange County line. That's going to be making a push down towards the Rockland line about 630. It'll be down like around the metro areas around 7 o'clock or so. Bigger picture is going to show you. Nice air mass for Friday, except right here. Watch out for that later in the day. And it's not going to be just a light little shower. Could be a real heavy downpour that comes through. So this is showing 730, a little bit of that rain. Maybe in New York City. It certainly gets weaker as it pushes to the south, closer to the ocean. Then nice skies for Friday, but later in the day, 7 p.m., that storm has rolled in. It's probably like around 4 p.m. for our just nipping at our western suburbs. 7 p.m., it's, it's basically covering the heart of the tri-state area. And that's, again, not just a light little shower. You're not going to see much of it. It's going to come in. It's going to get out very quickly. But... I mean, it's going to make its presence felt, and then boom, it's all about the heat on Saturday. Look at the numbers, forecasting 92 on Saturday, 90 on Sunday. So uh, we all love hey, this early taste of summer, except remember, I mean, kids are still in school, so they've got their soccer tournaments, they've got lacrosse tournaments, they've got whatever going on this weekend. Just, you know, do the smart thing if, if you're one of the coaches, raise your hand. Um, and and you got to hydrate the kids because you do not underestimate the heat. Humidity is going to be in effect. you got to drink water. It's the way to naturally air condition your body. So when you're, you're making your subs coming in and out, make those kids drink, even if they don't reach for the water bottle. And everybody, adults, you got to drink your water out there. You could be hitting the mid or upper 90s in New Jersey, and you pace yourself, and you will find relief at the shoreline where water temperatures are still in the upper 50s or lower 60s. Here's how I see it across the board. 76 for Friday. Uh, again, a rogue storm is possible in the afternoon. All in all, a better looking day. But watch out for that rogue storm. 92 Saturday, 90 on Sunday. The rain that comes in late Sunday is going to really cool us off into the 70s, if not the 60s, for next week. Dana, that's my seven day forecast. It's all yours. <laughs> it's very hot. Thanks.